Okay, so here we have um, somewhere we're going to have to write these out. And again, we're paying attention to place value. That's what's so crucial in all of this. Okay, so the best thing to do is just to read it out loud and then write out what we're reading. So this is 0 0.5, which means we would read the decimal and then the place value. So this is 5 in the tenths position. So to write that out, we would write it as 5 tenths. And that's exactly how it would read. Now what about if we have that whole number part in there too? Here we have 4.025. So this is four whole ones and, remember our decimal is and, then we would read the decimal and then the place value. So this would be four and twenty-five tenths hundredths thousandths. So we would have four and twenty-five thousandths. And that's how that would read. So we want to practice that so we get our place value down really good. All right, lastly, this says write each decimal in numbers. So instead of it being written out, we're going to have to write it um, in number form. So here we have 6 and 7 tenths. Well, our and there, that's our decimal point. So here we have 6 and 7 in the tenths position. So is that what that says? 6 and 7 in the tenths position? Absolutely. So our answer would be 6.7. Let's try another one. Here we have 420 and 8 thousandths. Well, there's our decimal is our and. 420, well, we can write that easy enough. But this says 8 thousandths. A thousandths position, remember your positions after the decimal are tenths, hundredths, thousandths. So if we're going to have eight in the thousandths position, it doesn't tell us about the numbers in front. We have to fill those in with zeros. So this would be 420 and eight in the thousandths position. All right, one more of these. Here we have 75 and 30 thousandths. So here's our decimal point. 75 would be our whole number portion. And 30 thousandths, well again, we need our place value properly. So this would be tenths, hundredths, thousandths. And if it says 30 thousandths, this would read 30 ending up in the thousandths position. And because they didn't tell us anything about this, we have to add a zero. So this would be 75 and 30 in the thousandths position. 